Tan, welcome back to carburetorsandmore.com, 832-221-4007. All right, well, you got a whole different animal there when you brought it in. Okay. As you can see, nobody's touching it. Okay, put it in gear and we'll see what the old gal will pull. I'm just, I'm just watching something else for curiosity here too. One customer told us that the smaller the carburetor, the more vacuum it sucks. I said that doesn't make any sense because how much vacuum it sucks determines how much fuel it can suck into a cylinder to make an explosion. I would say we had never even thought about this before, but I would say that all engines suck the same. Because if they're going to have an explosion in there, they all take the same amount of uh, uh, fuel to air ratio. I don't care what it is at sea level. Now look at here. They all go about 18. That's it. Proves my theory right there. The next time we get one of them big 1200 and 900s on here, I'm going to look at it again. That's it. Be heading your way.